Hello, my name is Kanat. I'm a laboratory technician at Mechanical Engineering Department. Today we will show you how to use uh, fluid friction apparatus from our field. Uh, fluid friction apparatus is designed to study the flow ahead, ahead losses in pipes, valves and uh, measuring devices. This equipment is uh, operated in conjunction with hydraulic winch. It's also from our field. Hydraulic winch uh, is multifunctional uh, equipment. It can be used with several uh, other equipments. Uh, water uh, comes from this point and goes in this direction. Uh, here you can see uh, wells, five types of wells, and uh, according to which uh, pipe is used, you just open uh, this well. And here also you can see two wells, also there. Uh, responsible for the flow for water. In this part, there are uh, examples, uh, samples of the pipes uh, used in this system. Uh, during the experiment, the students can uh, measure the diameter of this sample, uh, which is uh, suitable for the pipe in the experiment. Uh, this is a manometer, water manometer, uh, which, height, which height is uh, 1000 millimeters. And this manometer is used to uh, measure uh, head losses uh, in the pipes. Uh, in this part, the, we see that uh, here is a scale, level scale, uh, which is used to uh, measure flow rate. Uh, this is control valve. Where we can control the flow rate, and this part is uh, contains the button uh, to start this equipment. Before measurement of uh, flow rate, uh, you have to close this damp valve. Uh, see, this valve is closed, and uh, after uh, doing the experiment, uh, you have to open this valve again. You know to, you know to uh, the water uh, sinks to the water tank. Uh, now I will show you how to uh, perform the experiment exercise C uh, with roughneck pipe. This is uh, the last pipe. Is uh, roughneck uh, inside this roughneck, and uh, to do this uh, we have to. First, uh, we have to connect uh, the outlet pipes from mon monometer to these points. You just pull these tappings to this point, and uh, you have to ensure that this uh, well is open. Then, uh, just check that uh, this uh, gate well is open too, and this. Uh, Wave is called. After checking all positions of wheels and gates, uh, you have to start the hydraulics machine. Uh, before start, uh, be sure that this valve, this valve is closed. Uh, in this direction, we open the valve, and in this direction. We close the valve. To start the machine, you have to push this button. Uh, before starting measurements, uh, you have to be you have to ensure that this uh, level in these manometers are the same. I want to say that this uh, level scale uh, contains uh, consists of two parts. Uh, one small uh, till six liter, then, and uh, the second one is uh, to forty liters. Uh, the small part is for flow, uh, low flow rates, and uh, the upper part is for uh, big flow rates. So let's start. Uh, here we should open the control valve anti-clockwise direction uh, 
and wait uh, and start uh, timing and we should wait uh, till it will be for example three liters and stop here also you should uh, uh, you need help of your groupmates in order to uh, get uh, to give, uh, get uh, readings from monometers at the same time when uh, you uh, take <coughs> you make uh, timings in the hydraulic bench uh, one of the your class uh, groupmates uh, should take uh, values from these uh, monometers now we have uh, these values of head loss our first one is uh, near the 275 and second head loss is, uh, is 240 millimeters here is the example of uh, how you, sh you have to fill the table and make your calculations using the formulas in the instruction manual uh, here we have a Reynolds number uh, in this number, so it means that uh, our flow is turbulent. After completing your experiment, uh, you have uh, to close the control wave and uh, press this button. And don't forget to uh, close the damper also. Now about the maintenance uh, of this machine. The hydraulics bench is molded with this part called RCDs to prevent uh, from electrical damage and uh, to save the operator when something is wrong with electricity. Before reach starting you have to check this part uh, by pressing this button. Uh, when we press this button uh, this uh, should be triggered and it means that this uh, RCDs works, it's working. So then uh, you can start the experiment by pressing this button uh, and start the machine. Then, uh, when uh, you will not use this equipment for a long time, uh, you have to drain the water uh, through this pipe. Uh, here is draining valve. You should open this valve and drain the water 